Alright mate, so today we're going to be testing 10 Spanish treats. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah. Oh yeah. Ah. Right. You know, I like my cakes like I like my women. Uh, so we're going to be starting with something I've already had before. Woo! He, who, he, who, Westos. Let's see what it's all about there. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's a, you know, cheeky bar. I can't remember which one it reminds me of. You might know it all. One sec. Oh, wafer. Chocolate and wafer. It's not time out, is it? Really good. Good little biscuit. Westos. Next, Fusion Lab. Strawberry and chocolate. That's one of my favourite mixes. You can see if it's open because I'm a hungry boy. Uh, <laughs> it's creamy goodness. Bit of stuff. Bit of strawberry and that. Bit of like cream and that. Do you know what I mean? Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. <laughs> oh my god. Sorry, that's all the video's gonna be. Just me green. Mm. Uh, yeah, it's so good. Um, I wouldn't share it with anyone. No, get your own. Um, but it's fantastic. And malting. No, like they have malt, don't they? So they've got malt vinegar. So hopefully it's not like that. Let's, let's give it a crack, innit? Whee! Oh, wow. Oh, 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 what's that taste? What is that taste? What the f That's so weird. Right, I'm gonna try and describe it. What is that taste? That's how I taste. You know, like people who aren't tasting, they go, hmm, and they're going, ah, ah. <laughs> I feel like I've had it before I was born. Do you know what I mean? Like it's an old taste. I can't, I can't even, I can't even describe it. It's sort of like wood. Okay, so that's, that's cleansed their palate. On to the next. Look at that, right? Now this is what I saw when I bought it. Um, sort of cookie-esque, you know, like circles. It actually, it's just chocolate bits. It's just chocolate, just chocolate bits, isn't it? It's just, just is, just, just. Mm. Have, have you ever seen these in the UK? They look like torpedoes. Look at the cut. If you could see the colours, look, eh. look at that. That's a proper re number in it. They don't get them blues in, anymore in the UK. Looks like it's got proper dangerous chemicals in it. Mmm. <laughs> Basically, torpedoes. I have a firm belief that if you don't like licorice, you need to grow up. If you don't like it, you've just got the palate of a child. So these little numbers are bar eaters. It's got cookies on it. A summer. It looks like an Oreo, right? So it's not going to be the hazelnut stuff. Like I don't like Nutella. I don't like the the weird Ferrero Rocher things. If you don't like it, you've just got the palate of a child. So hopefully this is, is more Oreo-esque. Look at the midsection. Oh. Oh. Mmm. Yeah. It might be because I'm eating a lot of sweets. And the first taste I'm like, no. But it's like, it's actually alright. Ah. Oh. It doesn't taste of Oreos. At all. Uh, it's actually... Oh. What the... F actually. Oh, it's got like a salty taste to it. It's actually alright. Oh! Oh, I've got a bit of a headache, so I'm wondering if I'm having like a sweet override. Diabetes. Something I've never tried. Acid! <laughs> I've always wondered what a would be like. <laughs> oh, when you open the bag, it proper just hits you. Oh, it's roller, roller cola. Roller cola bottles, you know, like the actual sweet. Oh, yeah. So we've got the blue. And the cola. Okay, it doesn't look delicious. Kind of looks off. 
like something you'd find down the back of the carpet. The back of the carpet? What am I on about? <laughs> oh. As a kid, I would have just... Oh, sorry with that. As a kid, I would have demolished these. Oh, look at that. Look at that chrome blue. Definitely some, some dodgy ingredients here. Oh, oh yeah. That's from the 90s. That's bang out the 90s. The Panda Pops, the blue ones. That's them. That's that all over. Mmm. But sorry. But. Right. Oh. Right. Chocolate Gutas. Just saw it on the side. Didn't really think anything of it. I've done it again. It's chocolate chips in it. No, I'm not, I'm not doing that again. <laughs> I've already cleaned up once, I won't do it again. Oh, definitely dark. Mmm, they melt in, is it? What can you say? Good stuff. There's nothing worse when you get older and you start losing the taste for things you loved. Like music, happiness. Number nine! Cherries look your Ooh, amazing. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Look at this. And this is a Christmas special, isn't it? Disaster struck. What I didn't realise is when I was recording is that my batteries were low. And so it died. So that's not great. Uh, so let's get ready and let's add some continuity. Good as new. Uh, so what's next? She's my cherry pie! This isn't just cherry liqueur. It's Spanish cherry liqueur. Uh, uh, alcohol, cherries, fresh, dessert. It is banging. One of the best chocolates going. It's got that, that proper strong liqueur, dark chocolate, cherry taste. Get your gram. Some of these. And finally, we're on to number 10. Number 10 is one I had before, obviously. And it's the best muffin I've ever had in my life. Junior Brownie! You know, I like my cakes like I like my women. Rich, moist, and fudgy blondes. Oh, good for the peel and everything. Look at that. Oh. It's, it's given to you on a, on a platter. You ready for this? Mm. It touches your tongue and it just melts. It's so good. It's not too sweet. It's not dry, which is the biggest problem with most muffins and cakes and that. Oh. So, that concludes our taste test. Please switch on to the next video. Comment anything if there's any treats you like from Spain or anything that you enjoy that's foreign. Please like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And we'll see you on the next one. Do a taste test video, they said. It'll be good content, they said. Jesus Christ.